In America, you can't go to a baseball game or an amusement park or even celebrate 4th of July without spotting a hot dog. Americans love them. In fact, they eat about 20 billion hot dogs a year. But what's exactly in one anyway? It all starts with the trimmings. That's an industry term for the parts of pork and beef that meat processors can't use, but it can include head meat, animal feet and skin, and other edible slaughter byproducts, whatever that means. The trimmings are then pre-cooked, and for good reason, it reduces the bacteria in the meat. Trimmings are exposed to more contaminants during slaughter than any other part of the animal. Then comes the meat batter. The meat is chopped and flavored with spices and preservatives till it forms a thick paste. That batter is then pumped with water or ice to keep it from going dry. The USDA actually regulates that. No more than 10% of the mixture can be water. What else is in a hot dog? Well, if it's a lower grade, it's usually beefed up with ingredients like dried milk, rice, and cereal. The higher grade stuff doesn't have those fillers. The mixture is then stuffed into casing, linked about every five inches, smoked, and cooked once more. So what about the casing? Well, natural casing is actually just fully cleaned animal intestines. But most makers use a super thin plastic casing and remove it before sending the frankfurters off for packaging. 